Man, there's 25, there's 30 people on both sides of here. Are you guys going crazy? All of you? We got some hot toys. We got crazy hair. Look at this. Look at this. I went to hot yoga today, guys. And I want to tell you this first. When I was at hot yoga, I finished up, I took a shower, and they had a little blow dryer thing. They put it for your hands, and I'm sitting there like... And then it would like go off, and I'd just be like... My hair came out so silky, shiny, and, and so beautiful. I was actually very enjoyable uh, with that. So, let's hop over on Twitch, guys. What's going on? Shelly, I did see your dono from yesterday, so we need to add you to Deadpool 13. I did see that uh, this uh, just like before. What up? I'm Jesse the Pop Collector, by the way. Well, yes. Yes, you are. Because that's what your name is. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. And... I got a bunch of things going on. My little screen here. And I got this thing going on. What's up, Impulse? Jonathan Funko Boston in the, his house. What's up, guys? Um, we got Way McCleary. I guess that's right. What's good? Uh, e Marvel, just a pop hunt collector on both sides. He's uh, playing both sides. And what's good, Hammer? From Matthew Rowe and Brandon Bernard. How's it going, Cletus? Man, I've been eating broccoli. On my broccoli diet. If you guys don't know, I'm a huge broccoli fan. And when I'm training for a fight that's coming in November, which another opponent um, said, I want to fight. Uh, future mustache with the, the Twitch follow. Bing, 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 boom. Um, I got another opponent last night. Uh, he was 20, he was like 24 and 3. He said, hey, you want to fight Cletus Selden today? He said, no. I was like, damn it. That's the second one. So we got, we're still looking for another one. Fight's going to be on ESPN+. Plus. You guys can watch it. Sign up for the week and then leave. Uh, what up, Billy the Kid? Man, do I got some stuff again. And I got, I got, um, I, I started playing with this guy again. I started playing with this thing again. So I just go like this and I can just switch the cameras. Or this one. I can just switch the cameras. But like, life is good again. Hi. Hey. What's going on? You want to play? Let's do stuff. I like that. <laughs> I'm out of my mind. I mean, I don't eat no carbs either. So, uh, Brittany gave me like, Punky gave me like, uh, two pieces of cheese. I was like, ooh, this is nice. What up, Tank? How you doing? Man, this is my third hot toy in less than a week. I got one more. Four hot toys, one week. I found some extra money. I said, hell, I gotta let it go burn through that. And this is like, it's not even like money money. I just found it. I was like, oh, what can I get myself into? And that's where this thing comes first. And if you guys watched yesterday, we did a beautiful unboxing of the bank robber joker. So I'm just looking for a Niz knife around here's ear. So we can crack this bad boy open. I even brought the light box out for us to make life a little bit flocking easier for us. And where is that good old knife? Aha! Got it right here. Now, we're going to shoot a little bit of a YouTube video. Another hot toy. Wow, I know. So, guys. You guys have seen me collect Funko Pops. I own 2,500 Funko Pops in two and a half years. <coughs> that's not even... I think that's like five Funko Pops a day. Like, yeah. What, I don't, what's the math in that? Somebody bring that up the math. What is the math? 2,500 Funko Pops in two and a half years. Somebody get that. Now, it's crazy. So, when people say, oh, you're addicted to hot toys, you got the hot toy thing. No, I'm a full-blown addict. Now, I want to make a YouTube video, so we're going to do a little bit of that too. Bless you, Punky. Thanks. What's going on, YouTube? Welcome to Life Cletus. Today... We have our third hot toy in just less than a week, and I bought this off of Facebook. So I want to thank my pal, Jose Oreo, from uh, Chicago, for the sale on this hot toy here. Um, yeah, I have a addiction to whatever I touch. How do I thumbs up on the phone? I don't know. What's up, the cards? Um, I have a... 
hot toy addiction now and a funk addiction and addiction addiction. But I want to thank this gentleman here. He was listening it on the market on Facebook and I inboxed him and said, what's up? He sent me over this bad boy. It's supposed to be in pristine condition. I think it's my first one buying without a shipper box, by the way. Yeah. And we're going to make a shelf tonight. And we're going to display this thing. We're going to find some poses. We're going to play around. Um, I am also going to do a video coming up soon with uh, everything you guys need to start your own YouTube channel. So please, everybody, please like this video and subscribe if you haven't already. 347 per day. So I bought three and a half pops. My math is wrong. So I bought three and a half pops every day for two and a half years. Are we going to see more hot toy reviews from you? And which other ones are you looking for? I am looking for <laughs> every one of them. No, we're going to see a lot more hot toy stuff. Um, so what I'm going to do first is I'm going to do unboxing videos here on the channel first. And then I'm going to get into the reviews of them because I'm going to be fairly new of it and I don't want to waste any time. So what I'm going to do is just do unboxing videos. I'm going to go play around with some poses and show things inside of it and keep it at there. I know there's some great YouTubers who do this already and I don't know what the hell articulation, double joints, shoulder bend, snap, crackle, and pop means besides pop. In Funko terms. So let's crack this bad boy open. 14, 15 shipped. And I bought this on like Tuesday. I bought this Tuesday. It came today. I bought another Hot Toy Wednesday. Yeah. I'm going crazy. Let's uh, let's see you guys not stare at my address because you guys are perverted. But let's crack this bad boy open. Eh, without stabbing the content inside. Ooh. I like toys. $35 <laughs> a day for pops. That's crazy. No, that's not the question. The question is, the question was, Tank, how many pops would somebody buy if they bought... Okay, here it is right here. It's 2.77 per day, average, 900 days, 2,500 pops. There we go. What up, Pop Collector 101? Um, sup, playing Super Smash Bros. Smash Bros. is pretty cool. So, I bought three pops a day for three years. Two and a half years. And we're not talking about regular ass pops either. We're talking about all the grails, all the commons. All exclusives, all of the all of the all. That's ridiculous. We have problems. Now, let's check this bad boy out. He wasn't kidding. Uh, this guy, so this is my first time buying off of um, Facebook hot toys. The guy must be a known seller. He's like, well, because I'm trying to negotiate back and forth. And then uh, I was trying to get a little bit out of it. And I was like, you know what? I'm going to take it. But he's like, oh, well, I can do friends and family. I'm like, hell no friends and family, but he's like, he had plenty of references and all that stuff. I was like, uh, well, here it is, folks. Move this box out of here. There's no $20 bill in here. It's the last box in the box. But there it is. Great packaging. Great, uh, great packaging for sure. These, uh, these collectors do not play when it comes to that. I wonder if they have, like, protectors for these. I would love to get a protector for the other two because then I can display them. And I have many more. Right now, I put them all back in their shipper boxes in the plastic. So let's check it out. Oh, bubble wrap. This man was good. And you could tell the type of collector, too, by the way he taped it. See how it's like perfectly taped, like a great present? He did a great job. Um, Houses and probably look close to like mine. And the tape's all perfect. Good quality tape he taped it in. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Uh, we have another hot toy coming Wednesday. 
And that'll be my official one week of uh, Hot Toys. I would buy more, but I'm leaving on Monday. All right. Oh, good tape. Good, 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 good man. Hold on. Wait a second. Oh, yeah. Here we go. And uh, I probably can do this, right? Yeah, I can do stuff like this. We can do that stuff here. Oh, oh boy. Oh, oh. Oh. But would you look at that mother flocker? So excited for my hot toy. I went out and bought a new display bookcase. It's crazy. These things are the greatest, guys. Save your money. Buy some of these things. At least one of them. Don't collect just the uh, Funko Pops because what I'm really going to be enjoying doing on here is taking these hot toys and putting them with my Grail Funko Pops. Yes. They are, even the Iron Patriot. There's an Iron Patriot hot toy. There's a Red Skull hot toy. There's, there's like Hawkeye and those other ones. But I don't think I'm going to get those. But uh, who else we have up here? Wolverine, um, when the new Phoenix movie comes out, they'll probably make a new Phoenix. I don't like the Ghost Rider one, but I do like, like, I'm going to have to leave it for Punky. We got the mall coming. I like that kind of scheme. What do you guys think about that? I think that's pretty cool, right? Hot Toys and Grails over Commons. Hi, Cletus. J High Five 2. J Five 2. That makes so much sense. Would you rather have 15 Commons or would you rather have one of these? And I, I went to Hot Topic and used that Hot Cash. It was not what we, uh, it's not how it used to be. Let me move this out. By the way, I got this, um, this box from uh, Amazon um, not too long ago. Um, on the box here, you can see Bane, uh, one six scale collectible figurine, Dark Knight Rises. Uh, the Joker one, the eyes would move. And on the side, we got Dark Knight Rises. Dark Knight Rises, I'm going to put it up top here. On the back, we just have everyone who created it. And uh, there's a little thing up here, but I don't think the boxes care in that much matter. And then we got the game. Let the games begin. <laughs> I tried to find this movie last night and this morning. I just couldn't find it. Now let's see if an overview like this. Oh my God. Only here. Only on this channel, folks. You get this kind of uh, camera ability skills for a Funko Pop channel. Woo! <laughs> oh boy! Oh my lord! Would you look at that guy? He's buff too. He's a little build. I've been playing around with these uh, Deadpool. He's a skinny little bastard. Same thing with Heath Ledger's Joker. Oh my lord! Holy lordy, 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 lordy. What up, Drew Bids? I did remember to do a video. I recorded it yesterday. You can thank um, our boy, uh, FM McGinnis, because he was talking about it on his channel, and I was like, bam. Where's the pops? Uh, these things are for little kids. Uh, if only they had an anime a Hot Toys. No, don't say that. Holy hell, I'd go crazy, Drew Vids. I'd go nuts. Uh, uh, you don't even want to think I see some um, high-end uh, Dragon Ball Z stuff. Uh, get Neon. Hot, yes, I'm going to get the neon one, and I'm going to um, sell that thing. What up, Bradley da uh, Daly? Brandon Daly. Uh, because that's supposed to be a New York Comic Con exclusive. It's supposed to be a New York Comic Con exclusive. And I do want to get some Iron Man, but I want to get Mark 1 through Mark 7. Die cast, and I'm going to start doing them um, possibly in a week or so. We're going to start buying them. And uh, pre-ordering them. They're all for pre-order, basically. And then I want to get the little things that they go in. And then I want to, um, as that is pre-ordering, we're going to get the old setup that he has. He has, like, this um, this one that um, Tony Stark, he's, like, rebuilding one of them. And he's like a, it's like a diorama thing. There's, like, one he's sitting down at his desk and he's doing stuff. So we're going to have fun with that. A lot of fun. So let's unbox this some something. Look, perfect condition too. Um, the one thing you gotta say about these hot toys collectors, they know how much money they're spending. So they wanna make sure 
they take care of the packaging and box. Holy Lord, oh my Lord, oh my Lord. What do you think of the figure figures from NECA compared to Hot Toys? I haven't seen the figure figures one, but as of right now, these things are, um, are well known and named and they have all those licenses. So I don't know what figure figure has. Phantom Protector, clear display case for Hot Toys. Yes, Joyce Hamilton. That is beautiful. I am uh, happy with that. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. All right. I don't even, I even look at any sculpts or anything for this thing. Oh, this guy looks sick. Oh, look. Let's look at some accessories as we pull before we pull them out. You got like a half mask. Because oh, he breaks his mask. If I put that in his hand. That's cute. We got... I guess that goes on his arm sleeve for his other hand. And look. Look how he saved the tape for the character's head. Holy black and glory. Oh, you see what's on the bottom under there? That's what I'm looking for. We're just going to lay this right... Uh, we'll lay it on the other side. Up, oh, your arm fell off, Bane. One second. Lay Bane back down over here. Yeah, we'll put his arm back. The only thing I uh, don't like about these characters are, or these toys are, the, uh, the joints. Uh, it does come with a double extra one, like right here, but uh, I don't like how they separate. All right, so we got four hands. We got a little, we got a little bit of this. We got a little piece of hair. Where's my hair sweeper? Okay. We got a bunch of fists. We'll put those to the side. I haven't decided uh, how uh, until Joyce has said they have a actual protector for these. And they actually can find the spot to actually uh, put them out now. So I paid three hundred and ten doll hairs for this shit. Three hundred ten doll hairs shit um, on eBay. Go look them up right now. The prices are ridiculous. There's barely any bids, and uh, I don't think there's any bids actually on there. There are. There is a Cad Bane hot toy, guys. I had no idea. It's a Cad Bane hot toy. We were watching it. If it goes for less than 200 bucks, we can grab it. So, we got the Bane character out. Comes with another layer. Another layer of uh, some accessories. Ooh, wee, wee. Sweet ass, man. We got ourselves a little stand. It says Bane. It says Bane. Our little instructional manual. Oh, the jacket. You don't know how many times I try to buy one of these jackets. Oh, it's so smooth. Oh, look, you can put this in here. Oh, I love this collector. You, sir, a rock star. You got a little, in case it gets a little cold at night. And this goes on the stand. Oh, I love it. I love it, love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. Guys, I'm selling you on Hot Toys. I already know I'm doing it. I'm upset that I didn't get into the Funko booth. I know, like on my ego, it's, it's always uh, it's always annoying. I didn't get in last year, and I'm not getting in this year. I'm upset. I know, Cad Bane, a uh, best bounty hunter ever. Yes, gotta get the hot that Hot Toy. Hell yeah, I'm getting it. It's like a disguise one. He's like a he's like a uh, stormtrooper. All right, let's move this over just a tad here. Look at that bad boy. Oh, now I didn't look up any. And I mean any on any poses yet. I did see some when he's like on his knees. Like this, right? Now, let's see if we can back that up a little bit. Like he's on his knees and puts his hands behind his head. I have to switch his hands out. But he's sitting there like this. But he's on his knees. So we're going to have to look up some pretty cool... Uh, Pretty cool uh, poses. They have this little outfit here, so I'm pretty excited. Let me dress my uh, let me dress my toy here. Give me a second. Oh, actually, let's read this uh, instructional manual sheet. Usually it comes with like an A, B, C. This was released in my oh, not too sure. All right, take off the vest, back back. I do a little swiveling on that. We got. Put on a sash, get the sash on them. Um, interchangeable right fist and relaxing palm. 
Then we'll jack out brown the brown sweater and jacket. I'm not a big fan of the brown sweater. Uh, cautions. Don't put the head sculpt before turning it preferably. Okay. Uh, Non-detachable knee pads. And this is more stuff than Chinese. All right. Got what we need from there. Pretty dope. Pretty flocking dope. I guess I'll ask people outside of Funko Boo if they can help me out, get something for me. Yeah, that's not going to happen. You can try it though. You can try it though. Yes, it's a leather jacket. Um, the quality of this is uh, basically feels like a leather jacket. Not going to lie. I can uh, say that now. Now let's see. Is there like a technique to put these guys' arms in? I heard there was. Like, you're supposed to put their arms down and in the back. Let's see if we can get this down right. Down right and dirty, folks. Down right and dirty. Oof. So what we're going to do afterwards is look up some um, displays and poses that they have for our young man here. See, I did my homework on how to do, like, Make sure I put his body, his suit on and everything. So I did pretty good on that aspect of uh, life. And this is another great character from a one of the best trilogies of all time. Let's get that little hand in here, buddy. Hold on, let me, uh, let me dress my doll. I've been doing this for three days now. Uh, it happened last year. I got the statue... Better luck. The craziest thing about these uh the, the the booth is you know who wins the booth? The non collectors. Every time. The non collectors are in there every single time. It's uh mind boggling how they get in every time. You know what I should have done? Let's try this. Let me take off his hands. Hands. Uh, the one thing I don't like uh, is uh, taking these hands off and the feet off. Uh, I hate that sound. I feel like I'm always going to break it. Break it, break it, break it, break it, break it. Come on, buddy. Come on. There we go. We got one arm in. Now let's see if we get this arm in. Alright, I know you're not looking at much, but I'm over here playing with my toy. Dressing him, alright? Grown ass man, action figure style. I see why Jedi doesn't really like doing this on camera. Alright, let's put his, uh, eh, we'll leave that arm off until we figure out what we're gonna do with it. So we got him a little bit. He got a little numb, a little nub on his hand right now. This is probably go back in the box. I don't see me ever using that. This goes over his little forearm, so it looks pretty cool. And that is basically him standing. Uh, let's stand him up. We just got to find some poses for him now. I wonder if this, this doesn't go any higher. Oh, okay. Yeah. Here he goes. So we got to find some poses. See what's going to go on. Uh, Bane doesn't rock any guns, it seems. Bane doesn't rock any guns. Oh, yes. I got two things that I've been wanting for a very long time. In just two days. Two days. Oh, now Top Pops is getting in since he has a press pass. He's not in. He's not getting in. Um, I always win the lottery. I am a lottery winning machine. It happened last year. Da, 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 I got that one. Um, what up, FM McGinnis? How you doing, buddy? I want a Bane statue. Used to want the pop, but not into the older modes, older mold as much anymore. Yeah, uh, it's something, um, I don't know. So the pop goes for what right now on stash? Anybody? Let's go look. Pop goes for, let's see, Bane. Goes for 90 bucks. 
90 bucks. I paid 300 for this. 310. The pop itself. Compared to this, is two different worlds. And this price for this Bane has recently gone up. It's always been stuck at the, like 70 bucks forever. Forever, ever. Forever, ever? Forever, ever. I got the, um, behind me, the two pack for the Joker. So my goal recently, since last night, is to just make, I'm going to buy the Pops that go with the Grails. You can hear me say that before. I'm going to buy the Pops that go with the Grails, which is going to be fun. Especially with the Iron Man series. That thing's going to be crazy. Um, what I want to do real quick, too, is look up uh, some Bane poses. So we got Hot Toys, Bane poses, set, hike. Oh, hopefully we get something. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Give me some ideas. Okay, I like it. They got them punching somebody in the face. But Okay, you got this. We got this going on with it. We got the hands on the chest. I see that going on. More of the hands on the chest. You know when he's talking a little smack. Which, oh, got something going on here. He doesn't have any accessories when it comes to uh, weapons because he just beats the flock at everyone. They got him when he's like, pissed off and he's walking with his arms down. I like that. Okay, okay, okay. Now instead of looking at poses, let's just look up uh, Bane himself. Bane. Batman Bane. Let's see. And uh, Tom Hardy plays him, which is great. I definitely want to keep him with his jacket on. I do want to get the DX12 uh, Batman that comes out, which is going to be crazy. Uh, not when it comes out, when I go buy it. I almost bought one and the DX11. Uh, the DX11 and DX12 Hot Toys for about a thousand bucks for two of them. I think we're going to go with this. We're going to go with one of these. So with this going, we have this flap open like so. Oh, yeah. Get them like this. See if we can get them. This jacket going up a little bit. See if we can get them like. Oh, is he going to be able to move? Let's get this jacket on tight enough. Might have to take this, uh, wrist guard off his hand. Let's see. Does he not does he not want to move his arms? They had him like holding in, so let me see how they did that. Hit him like this. Hit him like this. Dish 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 dish. It's hot under here too. Well that jacket is even lined in separate material. I have no idea what that means, but yeah, it's crazy. Uh, great, I have to keep this video from my husband so I can surprise him. He's a Batman fan. Yeah, you gotta get him a villain something too. You gotta get him some kind of villain stuff because us us men love villain stuff. Um, I have a Superman Hot Toys. Henry, I'm not a big fan of him, but it's great they got one. He, it has a stand that holds him in mid-air. That's pretty awesome. I had a play around. Um, I eat Pop-Tarts. Okay, okay. I had a play around with this uh, yesterday. I've been playing around with these guys. These poses. So we're going to probably do the same exact thing with these guys that they would bane. And we're probably going to put them on one of these shelves down here. And uh, try to get our organization. I'm probably going to move this shelf down one. And it's going to go down there. And then Bane's going to go here. And then I want to get the Iron Man's that are going to go up top here. Yeah. So, that's what we got so far. Then I made this little shelf. You guys seen this yesterday. A little bit. A little bit. A little bit. A little bit. Yeah. Yummy. Yummy, 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 yummy. Now, let me see some more poses for this Bane character. Unless you guys find any of them, let me know, please. All right, let me see how I got this again. Um, and my screen capture is not working. They do got them, like, doing this with the shoulder elbow thing going on here. I need to get that. Maybe I bring his arms back a little bit. 
come on. Oh, look at that. Getting him there. Dude, holding that. What kind of hands have you got? We got four hands. We got another one that basically grips just like that. We're going to probably have to use that. We have an open palm smash. Open palm smash with the fist. Another one of these leather things. And half the helmet of the Batman. I guess we'll just probably leave that down there. But so far, what I've been enjoying is the fact to do the posing. The posing has been the funnest part. And the most stressful at the same time. Let me, uh, let me throw this on. Come on, buddy. Hand me. Give me a hand, sir. Uh, the DX ones are supposed to cost more. But they're supposed to be legit. Yeah, get that shoulder back. And I'm not one to, I'm not gonna lie, like, I'm not one to have, like, a new toy that's supposed to be very delicate or something. I'm very rough. Very rough. Ugh. You know that one scene when he's holding it? I seen it on the, uh, on the Google Images. Like, he's holding it like this, with his arms up. Come on, buddy. Come on. You're like a real man. You don't get arthritis. Ugh. Oh, he looks retarded. He looks patarded. Well, we're just going to keep you like this for now. Until we figure out what to do. Until we figure out what to do with your little Bane. Let me see some more images. They got him with his like arm, one foot forwards. One foot forwards. One foot back. Mm, let me pinch that down a little bit. Bend those knees. The crazy, uh, the crazy ways that these things bend. It's pretty awesome. And if you guys, um, they sell like accessories, which is pretty crazy. Uh, what that I've seen too. With the accessories, they sell like this iron. Uh, the, uh, Tony Stark in the opening scene that Funko never made. Of him like in that, that outfit, that jogging suit. And it has that, that light on his chest. Yeah. They sell that. Separately. From another company in China. But then you just gotta buy the doll that goes with it. That is uh, ridiculous. The one thing I didn't get to do yet. And I'm pretty jealous that uh, our boy did. Uh, FM McGinnis. He finished uh, Spider-Man. Did finish Spider-Man. Let me see how that looks. Um, I'm sweating a little bit. Uh, I saw Dark Knight Joker. It looks awesome. Ugh. Did you see that 2000 Spidey? They have up for pre-order. What? What? A 2000 what? I was born in the darkness. Bang. Love the lights on your shelf. Thank you. What do you think about Tom Hardy as Venom? I'm pretty excited. Um... When my hair is not purple, people have referenced me as looking like Tom Hardy. So, I'm pretty excited to see Venom. Um, I don't know if I'm going to be here. I'm not going to be here. I'm leaving for, I'm leaving for Florida on Monday, uh, which kind of sucks because I got to go back to work. And I hate going to work because I fight people for a practice. Like today. I had to fight people today for work. Because that's how I make a living. Alright. Let's play around. Let's clean some shelf space up over here. As Bane does his little thing for now. You know, one foot forward. A little action pose. A little bit. A little bit so far. Play around with him. Get, get to know him. Ask him about beautiful things. And I have no idea, J5's, about that, um, that hot toy. Because that, sir, would be uh, ridiculous. He said there's a sideshow has a hot toy, or not a hot toy, or something, up for 2K. Oh, man, there's so much stuff. They got so much stuff, guys. There's so much stuff on this damn website. 
I'm gonna go broke. Damn you, man. They got so much great stuff on here. I want to get that Iron Man uh, with the Mark 6, I think it is. Oh, they got life-size, legendary scale figure, C-3PO. $2,200. They had the speeder on the bike as well. Oh, and these are ready to ship now. I'm not going with the statues. I'm not going to statues. Only the one six scale figures. Oof. It's crazy. This is, this is Batman. What is that? Batman? Oh, I don't know, man. I'm, I'm looking at the screen right here, and I can't show you guys because the damn computer sucks. I, won't, I tried to work it before. It wasn't working. But, um... Uh, oh. Wait. Oh, this Tony Stark with that Gauntly, Gauntly, Gantly. I think it's a limited piece. They usually are. Most of these. Yeah, number, oh no, um, the Iron Man Mark IV with the Gantry. It's, uh, retail 635. It's up for pre-order. I think that's five or six. I want to get four. I want to get one through seven, basically. But I want to get one through seven, all the new ones. They got seven right here. So we got seven, four, and five. Seven, four, and five. So just, wait now. No, it's six. Oh no, I said with the suit. So we got six. That was going to just crazy. Two. Seven. <laughs> the war machine, I think is awesome looking. Oh, I can watch it. I'm going to go through the same shit again. I can't, I can't do it. They got a new... Ant-Man coming out. I don't know what to do. Uh, what do you guys think about today's video? And what do you guys think about yesterday's video? I think that was uh, some little, some of these little things. All these pops and toys are going to fill up your whole house. My storage unit is completely full to its max almost. If I move the rest of these boxes over, I got no more room in my storage facility. So, we got to start selling some Funko Pops soon. Pay for my hot toys addiction, <laughs> and uh, I like it though. I, the benefit of that happening is I get to display the actual figures that I'm buying. All gravy, all gravy. Go to hot side show. Look at the. Uh, I don't see it on there. I don't see it on there. What's new? What they write for anything new? Let me see if there's anything on what's new. I got that Princess Leia. They got some crazy statues though. That Venom one. Here's a uh, Spider-Man one. $2,000. What the fucking hell is this guy talking about? That says $2,000. Who is buying this? It's limited 275 pieces. What in the world? Swap out Mono 90 eyes. Big, about the size of your torso. I don't know, but that guy from the MCU, he probably buy the stuff. That's crazy. It's a damn statue. Does it come with that, I guess, too? That's crazy. Two thousand doll heads. And it's shipping soon. There's a New York City kind. Of, yes, I'm trying to get that. With very limited, I'm trying to get it. I'm not even going to the Fungal booth first. I'm going to the Hot Toys booth. It's a legendary scale figure. That thing, for $2,000, but it actually fly through the damn city. Like, craziness. I'm like you, Cletus. I bought three Hot Toys in the last month. I have two more on pre-order. Damn Jedi, he made me want this, uh, want them. Uh, yeah, I heard a lot, I didn't even, um, I didn't even really even get into the damn Hot Toys at all. Like, I wasn't gonna do it, but then I was getting a little mail with Funko, and I remember talking to the guy from, um, from Marvel, the Marvel, the Marvel director, uh, producer, and he was telling me how much 
he um, bought some hot toys, displayed them, put them in a box. Next thing you know, you look at them for two years, and they're worth like five times the value. Especially these ones that go for a movie. Because they don't make, like they'll always make a Princess Leia one. They'll always make a Luke Skywalker one. Because it's like part of it's Star Wars. But if you get like a movie, like the Spider-Man Homecoming one. That's my favorite Spider-Man one they got. In the deluxe version with the backpack. I mean, uh, with the, uh, the orange thing. I like that one. I like the deluxe version Rocket from Guardians of the Galaxy. I like the Groot from Guardians of the Galaxy. But, they already made them. And so, if I want to buy it now, it's like $250. Just recently, just uh, undone, sold. So, kind of pissed. So I bought the regular ass group. That's coming on Wednesday. Not disappointed. That's what the Jedi sold me on that one. Jedi definitely sold me on that damn group. I saw him playing with his. He sold me on that flocker for sure. But um, you guys can see the addiction right here. The same thing like no other. How much will New York City Comic Con Hot Toys cost? Probably, I think it's like two fifty, right? Hurry you can sell for six hundred dollars. And for me, I'm not really gonna be into it um, like that. So if there's ever gonna be an item for me to ever flip, it's gonna be that hot toy. And guess what? If I get that, and pay for that, it pays for this for free. That's what it's about, baby. Getting hot toys for free. Flipping hot toys. Different market. Glad to do it, I guess. Oh, Bane's going in. Oh, boy. This is awesome. This is awesome. Let's, uh, let's change this camera around. And, um, I'm going to leave that part of the video there. And we're going to pause that. Boom. Uh, what is that? Chat. Nope. Boom. Yeah, 250. Yeah, I have that baby Groot too. Jed Jedi man. Yeah, that that um he sold me on that Groot. He's like, oh man, I definitely buy that one. It was only like 143, you know, plus shipping and tax. I at the time, I'm not gonna lie. If Sideshow didn't do that thing where you can't return or you lose your deposit down for hold on one second guys look for yeah let's do this for um if, if they didn't do that i probably would have canceled it and went for the guardian of the galaxy one because it's only it was only at the time fifty dollars more but then it was going up more and more and more and more and more and more and more prices i said uh flock it flock it are you flipping New York City Comic Con hot toy on Boxing? I am flipping that thing. I am becoming a pure hot toy flipper. If there's a time to do it, and time to become one, it is now. Uh, I'm just going to literally buy it in the box. Uh, Pika, thank you for the... Pika Tube. Pika Tube. Thank you for the sub, uh, subscription on that one. Boom, let's get this down. Brain Daily for Batman, I was thinking... Of getting a tactical black suit instead of the regular. <sighs> Top Pops just sent me. Oh, what's going on, Major F Vlogs? How you doing, buddy? I just saw my guy, my Groot yesterday, and my clone trooper from Jedi today. My clone trooper yesterday. You got it from Jedi? I seen Jedi said he was selling something. You got some stuff. Were well, you the lucky, the lucky hot toy man? Um, let me go a little bit lower here. I got like this crazy contraption going on. Cassie Billions with the sub flock inscription as well. Doing big things over here tonight. This is uh not working out the way I planned. It's a little slanted. Hmm. This can go here. Maybe we'll play it just like that. We'll play it just like that. Let me go grab the uh, Bane. Common Funko Pop. Ah. One of the few Funko Pops that actually gets displayed on my uh, 
thing that's not valued at like crazy prices. So we are going to probably do something like this. Maybe. Something like that. Well, we might throw him in the back and just keep it like that. Yeah. I'm going to play some poses with him too. I want to really get that, uh, with him just holding that, holding this. That's going to be sick. I like it. I like it. I like it. I like it. The damn toys. I'm going, I'm going crazy for them. Joker one came out pretty good. That's the first Fungal Pop I ever got, guys, by the way. Uh, the Joker case came pretty good. Got to move his head around. I got to get some more, uh, Bane stuff. I don't think I got too much Bane stuff laying around. And, uh, that, I put that down there. These guys are going to go down here. Okay, okay, what do you guys think? Joe will probably end up becoming one. Becoming what one? Flippity flip flips. Thanks, man. I'm um, Ganek. I'm enjoying the content. Keep up the good work. Still hunting for Bane Pop. Ah, oh, I got him a while ago. I got him a long time ago. Got him a long time ago. Flip it, hustle to get more hot toys. Hell yeah. I'm doing it, boys. I'm doing it. Gotta hustle. Gotta get it, boys. We gotta get it. You should have to. I uh, have the Legion Collector Box. Yes, I do have that one. Perfect. Good job, Funko Boston. Um, yeah, I like that one too more than the uh, common anyway. Uh, the common one, and it was one of the worst subscription boxes that I thought. I thought it was one of the worst ones because they just gave us a great one. Um, the common was awesome, and then all of a sudden they hit us with that blocker annoyingness. There's the common, there's the Cad Bane, there's the Bane, which I liked at first, and then there's the Dark Knight Rises Bane. I do want to get, like I said, that DX11 and DX12 Batman. They got the Batman Armory. There's a whole armory. I gotta get that. I gotta get the stupid light to shoot. To get the bat signal. I have Legion Collection Bane. But need that one on Cletus's shelf. I got it. I got it. It's in the closet. Um, I'm doing a review of all the uh, Legion Collector's uh, boxes. And all the Star Wars ones. And all the Marvel ones. So that's actually out of storage. I could probably swipe out that pop protector. A better one. I like it. The only thing I don't like is he doesn't have any weapons yet. Like, this guy right here. Morgan Goodfellow. Thank you for your sub flock inscription. You're the man. Hi, Punky. Yeah, excellent. Hi, Punky. Like this one? Look at this. Came with all this money. I paid three. I paid the same amount for this that I paid for Bane. Comes with guns, shotgun, bullets, and ammo, and grenades of smoke grenades, big grenades. He even comes with this little thing that he pulls on the back. You gotta see with the shotgun. He has all these hands, and he comes with another head. Deadpool. There's enough said about him. He comes with everything possible. There's, I don't know how many hands are here. He has all these eyes. Comes with the heels. Got this. Here's his little pony. Somewhere around here. He comes with uh, these two daggers. And he comes with a display um, piece in the back that says Deadpool with shelves. So you know, you get a little bit more with those two guys. I know Bane's a, a crazy character, and he's simple, I guess. I wish he came with a little bit more. I wish he came with a little bit more. Just because I was spoiled with them. Give Bane one of the Deadpool guns. Actually, I can give him one of these. I got one of these just chilling. I got one of these guns just chilling. Maybe I give him the shotgun. Maybe he needs a shotgun. We need him some action pose time. No. 
No. No. What are we giving a grenade? Oh, you now we're getting crazy. Let's swipe out some hands here. Oh, he doesn't really have a good grip in hand. With a fist in one, he got two fists. Maybe that's what this is. This is two fist, maybe. That's what this is. This is two fist. Aha. Figure that out. That's what we're going to do. So he had two fists. That's what that look was. Um. So I'm guessing you got two fists. Let's try that out real quick. I want to play around with that. Oh, I hate taking these hands off. I feel like I'm going to break that little piece. Oh, all right. That one's actually really too bad. Stop being a little witch, Cletus. All right, let's go with this. Come on, give me a little nub here, buddy. Punky has been playing video games. I think she finally called it quits. No. No? She's been playing video games for about six hours now, guys. Six? What time you start? I think you started before that. Um, oh, give me that little... such death before that they were going to shut down my hospital. Oh, no, not your, hosp <laughs> not your hospital. Not your hospital, babe. Seems like every weekend you start over a new hospital. Oh, come on. Ah, there it was. I'm guessing we can get him to go with his arms, but it won't bend. <clears throat> Let me see if I take one of his arms out of here. If we can bend this guy's arms the way that we want to. Give us some hope. Eh, that was a hand. Give us some hope here. I'm trying to bend his arms up here. Yeah, I don't think he has it. Look at his big biceps, though. Hmm. I guess we can get him like there, I guess. That's where it is. Not there. Maybe we can get him there. If I get him there. Maybe. Because the arms don't go back any further. I don't want to break his joint. I'm not trying to give him some uh, arthritis. Should swap the Bane and Deadpool. Uh, I think Bane and Joker would want to be next to each other. Okay, okay, okay. We'll try it out. I was thinking the same thing. What episode is Punky on on Game of Thrones? Um... Yes, season five. She's called it quits until I um, come back from uh, uh, before well, I go to Florida. Because uh, she needs something to do while I'm away. Oh, I don't like doing it. Oh, is there any tips on how to take these things off? Anybody out there? Because I hate doing it so far. Oh, I feel like I'm going to break it every time. Is it supposed to feel like it's supposed to be broken every time? Uh, I guess we'll have to move the Bane up too because he's the newest one. His arm went in good. Uh, the quality of the jacket though was off the charts. Can't get his arm though. Damn. Not even close. There's a sculpt. There's a there's a pose on the computer. Well, if you Google them, they have them like grabbing his jacket and not shitty like I do it. Like do, 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 do. Oh not horrible. Oh, what did we do with this one? 
Maybe with, let me try it without the stupid jacket on. Now I'm getting mad. I'm going to hit Punky now. Get over here. You guys don't know the struggle on how to do this. Who's your favorite of the three? That's a tough one. That's really tough. That's really tough one. Um, maybe 66 Batman Hot Toy. They had all the cars too, I think. Uh, tell her to watch Outlander. Show. Like, I think she like that one. It's called Outlander. What was that other show your friend uh, said to watch? Punky? Um, Ozark. Ozark. Yeah, I guess I'm not going to be able to get him in that pose. Because this arm's not going either. Out of the three? If this guy didn't come with so much great stuff, like he comes with all this money and all this crazy stuff that's going on there, I would say different. But he does come with all the great stuff. And Deadpool looks smooth and he comes with another great, another bunch of great accessories. And I get him flying in the air. So far, my least favorite one is Bing. But he's iconic. He's an iconic character for me. And I gotta figure out how I wanna pose him. Having tough times right now. Going through tough times. Maybe get him like a little, a little boxer, a little boxing pose. Oh, imagine I have my own hot toy. That'd be crazy. Let's get this boxing pose on. Let's get this boxing pose on. Get his feet right. Let me get this hip joint going over here. Now we'll. Look. Karate stance. Not a big fan of this face right here, too. Down here, open up those hips. Tuck that shoulder. Okay, I see some action here. Let's see what happens this real quick. Let me see something real quick. Yeah. Get him down. Tight. I'm gonna put that. Maybe you have to go from a different angle. Got his stance nice and wide. Alignment's good. Big ass out. Oh, get your ring fixed. I'm gonna have to go with that. Get the chin down, buddy. Eyes up. Let me see that with the stand now. I'm gonna put the stand on the side. My angle here. Okay, okay, okay. Oh no. Top Pop sent there. We Top Pop doing a live stream? Come on! Uh, I don't even think Top Pops do live streams. And it's Pop Tarts, Pop Tarts, Pop Tarts. Who sent you guys? Who sent you? Let me go look at Top Pops' this thing. I'm trying to post some figurines here. Oh, Top Pops was live. I almost catch him in videos. I know he went live on his channel. Oh, thank you there, buddy. Well, thank you there, buddy. You little flocker. What do you got there over there? I got a Gretzky chase. I don't got a Crosby chase, though. But guess what? You guys haven't seen anything yet. If you guys are looking for grails, I'm the grail king of grails. If you're looking for a Funko Pop, that's highly sought after. I have it. Somewhere in here. You guys are looking for some Dragon Ball Z? I mean, uh, not Dragon Ball Z. Oh. You're looking for some Thundercats, Ghost Riders, some Freddies, some Star Wars stuff? I am the king of all kings. You like Deadpool? Well, I'm Deadpool. You want some customs? I got some customs. You want some prototypes? I got prototypes. You want to see some ceramic prototypes? Those ceramic prototypes. They go for about $2,000 a piece. There's only two ever made for each one. So, yes. 
Uh, Top Pop sent me. I don't think so. His name's Pop Tarts, folks. His Pop Tarts. He actually wants to see me at New York Comic Con. We're probably going to go hunting together. We might even go hunting for some some stuff together. Uh, Dragon Ball Z. I do have... I have all the Dragon Ball Z Pops. And there is a beer somewhere. Here's a... Um, Glow in the Dark White Ranger. There's a... Metallic Hulk under here, if you guys are into these kind of pops. Or if you're into uh, stuff like a eh, Headless Ned Stark. I have a Queen of Medela, but I don't know where I put her body. And there's a Frankenberry here, too. I know you guys like these things. Stuff and things. Stuff and things. But uh, this is just part of the collection. It's part of the collection. That's what we do here. So if you wouldn't mind subscribing for more great content, I'm doing uh, two, uh, there's a, eight, no, wait, what do we have? 3,800? I think it's like, what do we at? Like 7,000, 8,000 subscriber giveaway, I'm giving away a mystery box for somewhere around here. The horror mystery box giveaway at 8,000 subscribers. We're only about uh, 100, and, 100 away, 150 away. How hard is it to hit, like, how hard is it to hit, like, come on, people. There we go. Okay. I'll trade Buzz for Ned Stark. Um, no, thank you. If you, I would trade for Buzz. Let me go look on there real quick. Pop Talks, I'm looking on my one screen. Buzz. Thirteen ninety, ah, you are pretty good, huh? I'm not doing it though. You know why? Ned Mint two thousand dollar pop, easy, probably twenty four hundred. Once the show comes back around, ain't happening. There's no rehype for your show. Well, your pop, the great pop though. I will say, amazing pop. Love the sticker, but uh, oh my God, I'm in so much yeah. Out of all the uh, grails I would sell, is basically to Freddy's right now, or trade. I don't. I just don't have it. You guys like Star Wars stuff? Like, if you guys like pops, I have them all. I hoard them all. I have twenty five hundred pops. And Legos. I, got, I like my Legos too. Here's another good one. Secret. Secret good one. Secret. Top pops trade buzz for Ned Stark. What else is he adding? I'm not, try I'm not trading a grail that everybody wants. People want that thing. You better hold on to those ceramics. Uh, did you get a San Diego Comic Con Newt's Commander? Yes, I did. Somewhere in storage. I don't even know anything of the day. show or uh, movie. Don't even know. I like Star Wars. Oh, you like Star Wars? Well, let me show you around to the Star Wars center. Move this over a little bit. Get some room here. Sorry to the regulars. My regulars are probably like, oh my god, what is all this madness? So I stream on Twitch and YouTube. If you guys go to my Twitch account, which is twitch.tv life of Cletus, people want my buzz. People want your buzz. But they don't want... Your people are a little different. So up top here we got some Star Wars bounty hunters. Uh, it's a flocked wampa. And my little Sith section... You got a glow in the dark uh, holographic Darth Vader. You got a 501st clone trooper right here. You got a shadow trooper 2011. New York Comic Con Boba. Uh, going over here to making fun. Uh, Freddy. I just moved these mystery minis over here, but we got that Darth Maul going on a little bit. We got my like uh, Endor going on here. Got that Princess Leia, you got a flock wicket, and a little Chewbacca. Then down here, I got my like little pilot scene going on. That Freddy Funko uh, Yoda. This guy's going nowhere. But I got my little pilots going on here. Um, this isn't done yet, and there's a speeder there, and some more mystery minis. So, and then I haven't finished up these shelves, so I've been working little shelves at a time, Marvel stuff. Uh, these are all Grails. That you people call. Uh, if you like any of the Boba Fett droids, I have I have those. If you guys are uh, into those, 
There's this one, the European edition one. And this one is the 480-piece uh, San Diego Comic-Con 2013 one. So if you like Star Wars stuff, I am your guy. I own one of the, I own the largest Star Wars collection in the world. It's not official yet, but it will be. Uh, lucky I'm still on the hunt for Nukes of Scamander. I still, I don't even, I sit in there. It just sits there. It just sits there, guys. Uh, do you have DC? I have two, um, I have two green chrome Batmans. I got the uh, green Hornet Funko Pop San Diego Comic Con. And I have the the Flash and the Wonder Woman, but that's about it. The only other DC stuff I really got are these, that right there. And then I was playing around with this, uh, the Banes back there. So we just got the Hot Toy version. This just cost 300 bucks. That was 300 bucks, and that was like 260 So it's a lot of good stuff here. Someday. I got the share exclusive of that new Commander. And these are all the prototypes. I got these all from Funko, every single one of them. Uh, going to Funko events, they give me some private invites, and uh, got this from Fun Days. We got this from Fun Days. Fugitive Toys Party, uh, Funko headquarters gave us this. Um, one of the owners of Funko gave me that. Got this from a Fugitive Toys Party, Fugitive Toys Party, and that's a custom Cletus. And I pulled this at a uh, at Funko's headquarters, and that was gifted to me by the guy who gave me this. Who I met like in five seconds. Hammer that like button. There you go. There you go. I want your pop top pops. <laughs> do you have He-Man? No. No, I do not have He-Man. Um, out of that series, I've... Uh, who do we have over there? Just a Scareglow and a few uh, Ram Mans. Uh, Leonidas, Simpsons. Wizard of Oz, Teenage Mutant Turtles Metallic, Signed Funko Pop, Bruce Lee Bloodies. Um, those ones are very rare to find. Dirk, Directors, Dragon Ball Z, all of them. Um, Halo, Blockbuster, got that for free actually. And all of the possible ones that are kind of cool that you consider add icons. But I'm trying to get a pose for this guy right here. I just can't get it. I just can't get a cool pose like I got for these guys. These guys were so simple. These guys were so simple. Just can't get it. Do you have any diamond collections? My girlfriend, Punky, she only collects diamond series Funko Pops. So we have all of them. Well, mostly all of them. We're missing like the newest ones that came out. So we have all of them and they're out of box and they're in her thing. Uh, she does that, Adventure Time. What other ones do you like? Mickey and Nightmare Before Christmas. Those four. That's her stuff. How much for Teenage Mutant Turtles? Um, I don't sell my stuff, so they're not for sale. I don't know how much they go for. They go for less than what I paid for them. Especially those con stuff. If you didn't buy con stuff within the past, uh, like if you didn't buy them like this year, you kind of got screwed because the prices for everything have gone uh, insane. Insane, but they gave me a recommendation here the chat right before you guys came asking How it would look if I moved the Deadpool stuff down and the Bane stuff up So we're gonna try playing with that um, We also have a crazy unboxing. I mean uh, the, my 9,000 subscriber giveaway we have limited edition San Diego Comic Con stuff that this guy Mike H sent me, um, which is amazing. Sent me like an entire care package to give away, and I want to give it to you guys at 9,000 subscribers. We're gonna do that. Uh, there's a Freddy Fun Days T-shirt in there that you can only get from Freddy Fun Days, so it's gonna be pretty cool. I'm liking it. I'm liking it already. Uh, that was the metallic Deadpool. Uh, we got the glow in the dark one and the cheerleader one too. If you guys are into the con videos, uh, I post the best Comic Con videos on YouTube on the platform. Nobody does them better than us because I go to all of them. 
I want to say, yo, come, come, I'm going come, come, you come, 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 come. Most people don't like me too much because I'm like this world ranked professional boxer thing, right? I got this like belt or whatever, these awards, and knock people out. And I'm part of this uh, nerdy community, little geek community. Not everybody likes me because of that. Racism at its finest. Let's see. Back there, like that was. Boom. All right. Yeah. Yeah, boys. How's that looking? So we want to switch that up a little bit. Let's throw Deadpool in there. Get skinny. Yep. Just to lift his head up a little bit. Boom. So let's get a, a little overview here. Now, Bane, the only problem with Bane right now is he doesn't have too many accessories in his back. This goes up here. So you can see through the back here. So that is my only fault with him. Where to get more Bane stuff? You do you, Cletus. Let the haters... Leave the haters in the dust. Yeah, you just knock them flockers out, man. I can't wait to go back uh, speaking with the... Uh, when I get back on the mic for the press conferences, I'll know how much stuff we're going to be talking. It's going to be a little crazy. Because in the boxing community, I'm hated even more. Let's see if we get him to do a little Cletus stance here. Give him a elbow high. Get him low. See how low we can get him. Get him in the corner here. And the right hand up. Elbow high. Let's see if we get a little Cletus. A little Cletus boxing pose here. Actually, we gotta go this way. He has to go this way. Left hand forwards. Boom. We're gonna hit him with the hammer. Elbow high. How's it goes? Oh, I know it's on the back here. You see a little scar? A little scar there? Why did I not like it in the box community? Because I, I talk so much smack. And I'm the only, like, it's the only Jewish white kid in boxing. So, and I, and I come out very cocky, like I do in my videos. And a lot of people don't like me because of that. Everybody else, all these little humble guys, they barely even speak English. All right, all right. Let's see if we get that arm nice and tight. Bent over back here. See, I like to fight like this. I fight like I have the stance here. Um, I, 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 I punch really hard, and people don't like that. Uh, I use my forearms when I fight. They say I'm, yeah, I fight like a cheat, like a cheater. Let me get this down a little bit further. almost like the position like I would fight so when I fight like I said I fight like here like low here I throw my elbow so you try to punch me here in the elbow I boom I smash with the right hand it's just not holding up for this this pose there but yeah squat move those hips Almost like that. So it would be like somewhat like that position. A little bit a little bit lean back a little bit. And the guy throws the punch and you whack him out of the top. I can't believe I actually just did that with a toy. Let's see. Back. Ah. Definitely tough. Definitely tough to get it. Looks like he's taking a shiznit. Oh, maybe fight like a Russian. Let's throw him with the right arm back. 
Let me not have it. Lead arm pretty high. That Russian stance. Out of a movie. I guess that would be as close as you get for like a decent pose on him. Out of a, out of a boxing stance. You want that good angle. Look at that stance. It's flawless. Little well pointed toes here. Now every time you throw a punch, you'd open up that hip right here. So every time you throw a jab, his hip would open. Bing. 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 Can you beat McGregor? Yes. He can't box for shit. Shiznit. That's a pretty cool pose. I just need to find... I wonder, uh... How that would look in her. Not sold on this. Possibilities here. Maybe down the line, this is something we we'll have to do. Artists is getting crazy. I'm, uh, I'm facing them off. They're about to go down. Mayweather. That's that old school box stance. Hell yeah. I'm, uh, I got two flat feet, man. We got, them, we got them going off right quick. He's stepping on his money. He's like, hey, man. You got paid more than me in that film. Pretty good, that's pretty cool, not gonna lie. And we turn his head a little bit. Um, the Joker though, you know, a little bit, you don't got that strength like uh like Bane over here. I can see why these things are so addicting. That's so much fun to play with right now. Put your dukes up. It's a great pose. <laughs> you like that? Uh, can you be Mayweather? That pose looks great. Um, you got that light up Iron Man? Not yet. Not yet. Not the pop. I'm not getting the pop version. I'm buying any real Iron Mans. Uh, New York City Comic Con Grails? Yes. Uh, the Qui-Gon Jinn. How about that? There's only about five. I think he's like the fifth um, most expensive New York City Comic Con pop. He thought a Joker... His strength is his mind, yeah. He can take a good beating. He can take an incredible beating. I do like the fact that you can do stuff like this, especially with him. We'll go. We'll make him lefty real quick, just so you can see it. Get a little out going. I feel like these things would be fighting at night time. Eh. No, but the hips up again. Going lefty, bro. Put the dupes up. Fighting. Fighting. I want to keep that angle. Gotta keep that angle. Uh, he's not standing as well as he did before as a righty. Everybody else buys these things and they just leave them in their boxes and barely plays with them. Like, I've never seen Jedi play with his yet. This is actually pretty fun. That is pretty fun, I must say. That joke is off the charts though, huh? I guess I can move that. Like that, that over a little bit. Let's see how that looks. 
see how that works. Need two hands. Yeah. I like it a little bit different. It's a lot of bank robber jokers right there. That's a lot of bank robber. So that plays with his private. <laughs> so if everyone moving the date near Comic Con, what about Toy Tokyo? Any word? No, they shouldn't move anything. Uh, they do everything online. I like that pop. You got the nurse uniform for Joker? What? I think that's part of the first series. This is the 2.0 uh, version. 2.0 version. Buzz is going up there and up in value. Hell no, it ain't going more than Ned Stark. I'm buying, I bought this Ned Stark before I even watched the TV show. Then I, uh, I got it for 700 bucks. I will be selling it to, actually I'm keeping that one. I'm keeping this Ned Stark. I'm keeping the uh, Beyond the Wall Jon Snow, Ghost, and maybe the Mountain. I don't know, all the rest I'm selling. I own almost all of them. Well, Bane definitely looks better with his jacket on. I, I will say. I must say. I don't know what to do with this, this helmet either. It's just like a random ass helmet. Let me dress my um, my toy. I'm a grown man. You ain't watching Bellator? No, I don't watch the fights. I don't watch boxing. I don't watch UFC or MMA. I don't even watch wrestling. And do you guys know that's another day? The Ric Flair comes out. The Ric Flair comes out the 5th. I believe. From what I was told. Which I'm definitely... I already uh, bought from the WWE website. So, think about that. You got all those other pops coming out. Toy Story 4 is coming out. Yeah, but there's so many Toy Story Funko Pops. There's only one Ned Stark. Well, two. Come on, buddy. Get your little hand in there. Don't be a pricker. Why you think Top Pops wants to sell me? I oh, probably not even watch the show either. You probably can't even watch it. He can't even watch the show. Why does he want to trade? Because he knows it's a valued item. Recently, those uh, those bigger pops started going up in value. Just recently, though. More collectors coming around. I do like him with his jacket on. It does look a little bit more badass. I just gotta figure out some pose for his ass. You can't fight in this. Maybe he'll push his chest out. I've seen one where he's walking like this. Or is he just gonna stand here? Hey, I'm Bane. From a little Neil. Got a little Neil going on. With a double Neil. Sitting on them hips. That might be one. Oh. Foot vein. That might be a, uh, might be a pose there. Let's go pull that out. So far, the best part about these things is the posing. Uh, will Bait have some New York Comic Con pops? I think they will. I think they're gonna have the other 
the other um, Bruce Lee pop. I think I have the other Bruce Lee pop. All right. A little different. He just doesn't have that same... Well, these are a little bit older, I guess. That's what it is. These are a little bit older. Where do we go? Where do we go with the shirt? Do we put a shirt on him? Are you getting Metallic Game of Thrones near Comic Con at the store near Comic Con? Wait, wait, wait. The Metallic? Yes. Um, actually, I might go to the store. I might go to the store. Maybe we throw this on him. I don't know. The possibilities are crazy. And then I still have my smoke grenade here. Let me uh, put that back in. Boy, the Joker gets upset. Oh, and Joker got that Swiss blade too. You guys saw that yesterday? Look at this thing. I probably wouldn't be able to get on an airplane with this thing. Do they go sell out fast at the stores? The Game of Thrones ones always do. The Game of Thrones ones usually always. I don't know why I'm having so much a hard time posing this guy. After all the cool stuff I did with the other one. Let me, let's stop this and go look online real quick. I wish I could bring it with me. Let's switch sides. Um, please, um, have you heard Ric Flair drop? I heard it's supposed to be um, the same day as uh, the hell day for all of us. That's going to be a Looney Tunes one. Actually, let's go look at how Hot Toys did theirs. Hot Toys Bane 1 6. Let's see some poses that they did that maybe I can steal from them. Alright. They got him with his arms open, one foot on the in display. That's decent. Got like a wrestling pose. Oh, they got the tumbler. The tumbler looks. What's up? What's up, Dean? Oh, the tumbler. Oh, this is what they got you. They got him with his arms wide. Let me see what these hands look like. Let's see if we can switch some hands on. Switch some hands on him. What Ric Flair pop? The one he's holding the belt. The one he's holding the belt. Pre ordered that son of a gun. I guess how much it was. $150. So they got him in like wide. His hips are wide here. Oh, I can see that going on now. Okay. Well, okay. Look, it's getting like a little animal, a little savage animal. I'm gonna go put this thing back on. Make my life easier. Can't believe Funky's still going strong over there. I wish they gave you a hand so you can hold this. I don't know what the heck they do with this little guy. Mm. Alright, I'm feeling that a little bit. Let's see what they got going on. 
They got them more like here. Big arm. The hip is this way. Let me see what that look like. How's that look? Bye, I guess. Okay, Tippy. Thank you for stopping by. Drip. Where can I get your shirt? Can't get one. Um, Funko gave him just a few to give out. I have no more. Oh, I'm doing a 10,000 subscriber giveaway for one. Actually, signed. Just like this. I'm going to do only one 10,000 subscriber giveaway. Right here. One of these. And I'm going to send a frame. Um, if you live in a U.S. resident. If you are a U.S. resident. If not, uh, you have to get your own frame. The Deadpool hot toy you got looks great. You like that? I posed him up, doing his thing. I'm trying to get this Bane. I'm feeling Bane now. I'm feeling him a little bit. He's taking up more space at least. Let's see if we can get like the max out of him. Like, come on, come and get me. Let's see if I can get this hand off real quick. Ugh. Nope. I hate. My only complaint to these damn hands. The hands and the feet. There's this little piece here. That um, you gotta like get it from an angle. Oh, see how I'm like. I don't want to break it. My only complaint. They do um give you an extra one too. Hmm. Ah, you hear that snap? Don't like the snapping of the hands. Mm. Mm. How does all one go? With hands, hit the hand in the fist. Oh yeah, there we go. Hold on a second. Hold on one second. One of these actually holds his freaking head. How does he hold the head? Let me see him hold his head real quick. Gotta be this hand right here. Oh, maybe we get some action. Hold on, we might get a little crazy now. I think we might got something. Thinking of craziness, and I think I think we got it. After all this time. Come up. Come on down. Oh, get some air time. Uh, it's not like the, oh wait, this is this special thing. Hold on. So with this clip, you're supposed to lift it up a little bit and you can spread this here. You can spread it a little bit, then you can Pose him on it. And it's supposed to go. Yes, right up his ass. I wanted him to be like in the air. He's getting more. Uh, we're getting more involved with him though. Like he's looking, definitely looking better. He's definitely looking better. I wanted them to be like flying. One leg up. He's ready to smash you. Maybe we ain't gonna get that. I thought we're gonna get him going crazy in the air. Now he's holding his mask here. And what's he holding it by? Like this. Uh. 
Not the greatest grip here. I don't know how they got him holding this. He's holding like the top of the head. Yeah. I don't know. They got him like holding the top of the... Yeah, there's only one on the hand. This hand's wide open. Uh, you just need to play with it more and loosen it up to where you pose it. Thank you for that recommendation. I think you, you're right on. Um, you can do both hot toys. You do both, but hot toys are more fun. Hell yeah, look at me. Was over at your Pop Tart stream. Hey man, was. Hey man, was over at Pop Tart Stream. What's going on, Funko Vince? Yeah, I didn't even know he went live. I didn't even know he went live. Uh, the hot toys so far, you know. I usually buy the Funko Pops, put them shits right in the uh, storage. And sons of guns. I don't see him holding this. Unless it's like that. And that's. That's about it on that hand. I feel like that's going to fall. But, I didn't do it. <sighs> Pops and uh, Hot Toys is what it's going to be at. Pops, Pokemon, Legos, and Hot Toys. Pops, Pokemon, Legos, Hot Toys. Four. Four is the key. Feeling a little bit. They got no mystery mini Bane, huh? They ain't got nothing else Bane? What else can we buy as Bane accessories in real life? Apocalypse 101 back. Funko is doing a live fun cast on New York on Thursday, New York Comic Con, but then I saw the time. Pfft. Yeah, not worth it. 8, 9 p.m. I wonder if they have any parties. I'm going to go to the Fugitive Toys party on, on Saturday, I think it is. Cletus, are you going to get the Hot Toys Spider Game version? I think I might have to pre-order that flocker. I was. I was going to get it, but after looking up all of the uh, reviews and the fact that the Gamerverse uh, suit is made up by Insomnia, the company that made it, made up that suit. So I was like, eh, it's not an official one. I, would, I do want to get the Homecoming one. Not the Iron Spidey. I'm not really into the Iron Spidey one. But the Homecoming one. Animated Series Bane. That's the only other one, right? I got that one. Thank you, Sean Rose. No more Legos. My Lego collection's worth more than your Funko Pop collection, Dow54. I'm sorry to tell you that. And Dow54's been trying to get it in and scamming me for New York Comic Con stuff. Can't take it anymore. Bane. Wait, what do you got here? They got him holding the mask like it's easy. This shit is not easy, Howie. They got him holding that mask. They got him holding this mask. Look at the photo right now. Here. Like he's just holding it like this. Like he's holding it like, I'm actually he's holding it like this. And it's not, there's no way it's possible. I don't think I'm going to even get him, like that's the closest I'm going to get him holding that thing. What? Holding the mask, no big deal. Um, are you selling anything? Not right now, not right now. Have a, uh, I have a tough time letting it go. But I have... I'm going to let go of all my doubles though. Doubles of everything. Slowly. First starting with my Star Wars. I have 11 boxes of doubled Funko Pops. 
11 boxes of 15 of each box. It's 15 boxes. And they're all doubles. It's all doubles. 15, no, 11 boxes with 15 pops a piece in them. That's how many doubles I have. How fucking dumb is that? Maybe we've moved, uh, maybe this gets moved over like this. Okay, I see this. I see that. Get yourself joke. Move them, away, move them a little around. These things probably come come to life at night, huh? These things really coming around. Maybe put the mask under his boot. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Tank with the W. Can't go upside down. I get a little wider base here. And his knee. I got really good uh, reflexes, by the way, guys. All from boxing. Look. Let's see how we would do that. So he would get like one hand, one foot up here. This, uh... His base is not as good, like his, um, the pole base they have for him. Being so big, I guess, isn't as good. You look like you're going to snap that damn thing. You look like you're going to snap that. Ooh. What's up? Subscribe to me. Nope. Ah, uh, that's it. Thought you would have more than 165. 165 of what? I'm gonna be the guy slipping money at the Funko booth to people. <sighs> I hope not. You're paying a little. You're already paying that flip up price. I don't know how they cracked down on it. Last year they didn't really crack down on that. Maybe we gotta higher them up a little bit. Maybe that's my little issue here. Maybe we'll higher them up. So far, this is my least favorite one out of uh, Posen. That's decent. That's decent. That's pretty decent right there. Put the um, what I'm gonna do is I'll put the animated series one from the um, Legion of Collector box on the other side, and I'll take the Bane out of the box and put him uh, up top here. That'd be pretty cool. Now, I'm thinking I'm looking at this Bane, see how this one's posed, but that looks pretty decent right there. I'm not gonna lie, this hang can get a little thick a little bit. I feel like we gotta switch that hand out to a fist, though. Good idea, Tank. Yeah, that was awesome. 
if I can save fifty dollars or so on my fancy fa funky phantom, I'll do it. You always find that one. What's going on, Chase James Bell? How you doing, buddy? You like my videos? Thank you. I post a lot of videos. I'm almost. I almost post as many videos as Top Pops. He's up there with like eight and change. I'm up there as well with uh, almost uh, 800, I think. Think, think, I think, I think. I'm, I'm liking it. I'm digging it. I'm digging it. With his feet. I'm going to see if we do the curb stomp. That looks pretty dope. I'm liking it. I'm feeling it. The only thing I don't like is the background. You see I got nothing in the back yet? Uh, what I'll probably do... I like it. Good. Really cool. Thank you. What's going on, Alex and uh, Gene? What we got to do is get a insert for the back. Let's go see what they got on the good old YouTube. Oh, um, he's doing a Freddy Funko giveaway. That's why uh, Top Pops is doing that. I got you. Who won? Um, I'm going to say Bean. Uh, background. What's going to be fun? Like an insert. Or a... Um, Oh, yeah. Okay. Um, I wonder what they would call that. Like, say we got something like this. Let me show you on the computer. Which con booths have the best mystery box? Definitely going to be Chronos. Definitely going to be Chronos. Like, we get one of these for the background and put in that little uh, cubicle. That would be pretty sick. Now we gotta find it. You gotta see this thing. Like, so this is how they have this displayed here. And I don't know how the hell in the world they got him holding this thing because he's not holding it like that. But, check out the tumbler. Like, they got him on a tumbler. It's not fair. It's not fair. It's just not fair. I think the booth list is finalized. Check uh, New York Comic Con website. Yeah, that background looks awesome, right? Hell yeah. We get something crazy like that. Like we get like this, like a cardboard uh, cutout. We put it in the background. Yeah. Actually, let's go on Instagram real quick. Look up this. Hot. Oh, I need to get that. Funko Boss, you got this? Oh, you. Bastard. Hot toy. Bing. Damn it. Got it. Simple pose. You got the mask in the front. Hmm. Let's see if it's just. Meh. I don't know what to do here. I don't know what to do with that one. So this one guy I follow on Instagram. This dude. I wonder if he got a bane. He makes some crazy looking pictures too. Look at that. Let's see if he got a bean. I want to get that Mark 1. Bean, 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 bean. These are all custom outfits they do. You can buy these custom outfits on eBay. Bean. No DC stuff.
Okay, statues, excuse me. Oh, here we go. See, this one comes with the ride. This is the girl. See, this is a custom outfit here. You can buy this, then you buy the head and you put it on the body. It's like, a, it's like an $81 um, outfit and like an $80 uh, figure. You gotta buy the figure for like 80 bucks. Then you gotta buy the head and then the body. This is the Spider-Man I would get. I think that one was the best one. This Hawkeye. Ugh. Another one. That's that's not that's not a real person. Where is it? Come on, Bane man. Like I want this guy to have the Bane photos, not these awesome ones. That looks sick. I love that. We're gonna get a Wolverine. If we got the Fungal Pop Grail, we gotta get that. We gotta get that pop. I mean, uh, hot toy. Oh, here we go. Damn, this guy's good, huh? We ain't even do that. He carrying damn Joker. Holy flogging hell. This guy is good. Oh, I am done. He is good, huh? What else do we got here? Damn. He's good. Any other one? What is that display? Just a regular one? Just a regular thing he's carrying him on. Damn, he's good. You know that? guinea pig page I follow that have all the guinea pigs in the one male. Uh huh. The one male died. Uh -huh. Oh. Damn, that one guy, that guy was good, huh? And then he's, he's like I said, he's these shirts and stuff you, you can do. These outfits. That stinks, honey. Oh. Look at this guy. That's just nonsense. That's un that's nonsense. That's crazy. How did he do that? Ah. Next one we get. In. That's the next one we get. In. Man, this guy got so many things. He must sell. He must have a store. That's all. That's crazy. It's, that's just not right. I'm gonna get the new one of this. I think the old one's better, but I'm gonna get the new one. Alright, Papa. <sighs> Damn. That Bane pose was off the charts. Nothing else? I'm all done. You're all done? Yeah. For tonight. You played for that like That level is fucking up. I can't get past that level. You can't get past the level? I, try, I keep deleting buildings and getting money back, and I'm literally down to three offices. So I can't even. I just can't. Look at that picture. Guess what that guinea pig died of? What? Oh, Aww. I just bought a Bruce Wayne head sculpt for my Arkham Knight Batman. Are you ready to buy all the accessories? Let me take a Photoshop shot at a background. I'll mail it to your P.O. box. Hell yeah, Joyce. We got to get it though. I need get, get the size. So we'll just go like with the cube size. And then we'll just put up like um, half an inch bigger than on each side. And then I'll put it in the background. This is just, uh, you can see why these things are so addicting now. Look how awesome these people do these damn poses. Okay, we got a bean. How do you get his arm like that? I can't get his arm like this, for Christ's sakes. I can't bend his arm. Maybe his elbow out a little bit. Come 
Come on, give me something I need. That's the choke. I seen that one. He's like choking the guy. Man. Of course, the one that I got. He got barely any good poses. So it's a crazy one. The armory. Look at that thing. It's the armory. Holy hell. We're gonna go broke. We're gonna be selling fungal pops. That's the one I want. Oh, they got Achilles? Oh, my Lord. I love Achilles. If I was always going to say if I name him a boy, his name is Achilles. How many photos this man got? This guy's like the greatest funk, uh, hot toy guy I've seen so far. Man. Look, they got bikes and stuff. Like, this is, this is awesome. This is pretty cool. I gotta leave it there. Uh, where's the chat at? He would like that. A sign. What is it? I need to make Cletus selling a sign. Like I did for the three pack. Oh, you bought that? You made that up? I was wondering what that was in the background. I thought Jedi was crazy ass made that. Hot Punky, where are you? She's she's done. She's done. She's knocked out. This isn't Top Pops. And he asks for people too. Thanks for calling him out. What the hell are you guys talking about? Spamming every second. Where are we on this chat? Well, I just gave him away a Freddy Funko, so I'm glad whoever got that. Congratulations. Um, how many pops do I have? I have 2,500 Funko Pops. I have a $100,000 collection. Be right back. Okay. Punky, you're not on. Yeah, she's, she's shot. She has to go to work tomorrow. You got to make um. We got to make a cool sign. I don't know what we would use. You guys got hashtag Hammerhead. He has to be a top a toy dresser. And if he isn't, he should be. <laughs> Definitely should be a toy dresser for sure. That's crazy. <laughs> Look at that Thanos. That's just madness. Man, Hawkeye. I think there's one ending on uh, eBay. I got a bunch of stuff on eBay. Hot Toys Homecoming just ended, but it wasn't deluxe version, so it wasn't too far. Uh, send him a PayPal. Um, on eBay, I was watching a. Um, what do we got here? Ended. 270 it ended at. But I want a deluxe version. Like, it seems around like 300 bucks, 350 you can get some of these uh, older ones. That bank robber joker I got ended at three seventy five yesterday. I bought mine for three ten. I was trying to buy this uh, IG eighty eight. I put like a one thirty five bid in. It sold at one forty. Um, tomorrow night, there's these two. I'll check them out with you right here. I can only buy hot toys on eBay technically while I'm away. Um, because someone has to be holding the sign for them. So, this I'm not going to get. Um, oh, these are ending soon too? Is it active? Okay, so this. This is the Hulk. I didn't like the Hulk. But I did like this. Sorry I do this little ghetto. <gasps> the Vision. I thought the vision was pretty cool. This guy is selling a bunch of stuff. Here's the vision. Here's the Hulk. But I, I, I don't like the Hulk too much. Yeah. What? Yeah. Babe, I'm streaming. Get out of here. Yeah. Let me see. Be right back one second. Where are you?
sounds a little fishy. All right, all right, all right. STS, Funko Vlogger. What's up, what's up? Hey, Cletus, what's up, what's up? Uh, it was me for sure. I can hook you up. What would you like? Just your name, Hebrew Hammer, a logo. I think we have to make the chats, guys, uh, on that one. Hammerheads, I don't know. I just bought a Bruce Wayne head sculpt, so that one. The toy dresser, you guys are ridiculous. Uh, this was the other one we were looking at. Um, the Chewbacca one looks cool. It's a two-pack one. This one was dope, too. The Nick Fury. And that's the Avengers one. There's another one of him, too. There's two of them. That's the Avengers one. Here's Hawkeye, Age of Ultron. You can see where I'm going here with this, right? <sighs> now, this is what I was thinking of. This is, this is, this is, this is the one right here. I don't want to let me look at a big photo. Um, it's Iron Patriot. The reason I like him because we got the James Rhodes somewhere right over here. I got the James Rhodes one as the Iron Patriot, you know? Let me DM you on Instagram. Yes. Toy Medic is my age. Okay, I'll look it up. Thank you. How much is Deadpool? Uh, 250 You can still you can buy them off the website, so you don't have to pay uh, another market. I think about 250 it's 15 pops. Great guy, did one for Jedi, the three pack. Yeah, I, I never knew that who actually did that. I always thought it was a um I always thought it was just him made it himself. The Psycho. So you got that Cad Bane one. I mean, uh, that Iron um, Iron Patriot. Diecast one. This one we're definitely going for. Definitely going for this tomorrow. It's definitely on the list. For tomorrow. Here's another one. The Red Skull. Crazy. This is crazy. Is this the same seller? It is. Ah. Oh. Seller of a sea of items. He's selling this Cad Bane. He's selling this Red Skull. Not into the Bomb Squad. Alright, so he's just selling those. Oh. That Red Skull, right? That Red Skull. That red skull is not right, guys. <sighs> that red skull. Oh, man. Oh, man. This is the other one of the, the Hawkeye. So I got to look through those guys first. Captain Phasma. This is another thing. Look at this. I think it's um, Commissioner Gordon with the uh, Robin supposed to be the police officer. They had the bat signal. Unreal. Another Iron Patriot. That one's still sealed. Whiplash was pretty decent looking. Look how big he is. Look at that. Like, look at that. I'm supposed to buy a house. We can buy this for half a million dollars. <laughs> that guy's crazy. Ant Man. No bids. Uh, this is the Joker. We're following this too. It's 
that Joker. And it comes with the table, the diorama of the table. Oh. Let me show you this uh, Joker real quick. Hot Toys. Uh, DX11. Joker. Watch this thing. Oh boy. Let's get over to some photos. Comes with this pencil that stands up. You got him in his outfit with this table. This is uh, the light too. This is the one that um, Ken Poole has. Come with the cuffs, knives, and the pencil. Table. The other head. You got a machine gun. You got some money cards, joke cards. Now, another gun, um, and you got two, four, six, two, four, six. You got twelve hands, plus the ones on thirteen hands. Bam! That is why I have three in hand and another three on pre. <laughs> Oh man, addictive. I spent a lot of my time looking at sideshow and planning my next addiction. I've been doing it for the past week, guys. I bought three. I actually bought four. I don't blame so. I don't really blame Jedi on it, because Jedi. When I looked at Jedi stuff, Jedi had the Star Wars ones. I saw the Grievous one, and he said how delicate it was, and I was like, eh, Grievous is my favorite guy, and I was like, eh. And he has the Star Wars stuff, and he has them in the back, you know, in displayed all nice, and, but he doesn't go out there like, I'm over here showing you, like, me getting one, and then me posing these things was the game changer for me. Me doing these poses. Why? Me doing these poses is what like got me like hooked. The pose game got me going. I seen all the different heads and the different sculpts, all the accessories. That's what got me going. And then being able to come up with that little thing yesterday, swiping in the uh Find the Funko Pop. Well, having the Funko Pop that goes with it, with it, is another one. Crazy, 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 crazy. It's fun watching you play with hot toys. I love how excited you get. It's crazy, right? It's so much fun. <laughs> so much fun. I can't help it. If you can go over to YouTube, like and join. Yeah, Ristina. Uh, Christina uh, Payne, I think we're going to get you a, um, here, we're going to do this for you, Christina. I'm going to take this pop, this box right here, and we're going to write your name on it. I thought about this earlier today. For the number one mod for the channel, we're going to put on here, it's like this. Pop that back. We're going to go. Pain. That's this box yours. Deadpool 13 box is yours. With a Christina. Pain. You got Deadpool 13 box. How about that? How about that? If you can. We hear Miss. Uh, that's how you use in the damn bathroom. Water. Remember to smash that. Yeah. So, that's for you. You got that uh, Deadpool 13 box on there. Boom. Yeah. I'm liking it. I just got to get, uh, I got to get more hot toys so I can get more organized. 
Please, you rock. Thanks. Now nah, you do a great job. You always come in here help me out. We got to get more hot toys to get this uh, going. I need to get a Wolverine. For sure. I need to get a Wolverine. And... I guess we'll do it. I didn't think I was gonna. But we're gonna get the DX11 and D12. We're gonna throw them in one cubicle. And that's it. For the DC line. I want the armory one. I don't know. The armory one looks pretty cool. Maybe I'll get the armory one. And I'll get the Joker one. The DX11. I want the DX11 really bad. And I'll get the armory. And then that's it. And that's it. There we go working on our Marvel. And we got to pre-order the Star Wars ones. The good thing is I don't want too many um, Star Wars ones that are like not new. Even the Marvel ones. I don't really want too many new, I mean older Marvel stuff. I don't want the pre-order stuff. So that sounds good. What's up, Danny? Ms. Rena. Christina. Way to go, Ms. Christina. Yeah. Joker's killer, right? That thing is off the charts. He has all his money, too. And these cards. I just want to, uh, I just, and there's so many different ways to pose them, too. I love playing with him yesterday. We have the Bane the way we want him. Thanks to Tank. And, uh, I think some of you guys got them Pokemon cards recently. Sent some stuff out. But, I'm going to end this live stream here. I want to thank all you guys for coming in. Maybe we'll be able to do a stream tomorrow. Not sure. See what's going to go on. Tomorrow's like Jedi's Patrol's day of streaming. But if I, if I do anything... Look at that. We had nothing. I can't even think. We didn't have a single hot toy this week. Ever. We never had one. We never got one. I got this for my birthday. I bought this Deadpool for my birthday. And then look what happened. I bought that one. They all were crazy. The guy shit them out too. So fast. Holy fucking hell. Had zero. Now look at my collection. It's a great show. You're welcome, guys. Smash that like button. Hit that subscribe, like, comment, follow. I don't know, man. I didn't have a goddamn hot toy just, just, just a couple days ago. And look how awesome this looks. I'm so happy with this. I love it. I love it. The only problem is I got to figure out ways to uh, move some stuff the hell out of here. <laughs> because these look so cool. Hot toy in every shelf. Yes. Definitely going to go. We're definitely going to go we're gonna go down here, right? But this is where it gets interesting. Up here, I'm going to do that whole Iron Man. All the Iron Man stuff going to go there. We're probably going to be moving by then. And then um, we got all these shelves over here. I guess these will be hot toys. Hot toys, hot toys, hot toys. But we got to leave. Oh, we just do all these hot toys. Like, this could be a little theme. Like, I could move these guys out. And then put, like, uh, the Batman and the Joker in here. With some scenes. With the with something going on. Like, the Joker. Like, the Joker and Bane beating on his ass. Hammerhead's rule. Hell yeah, boys. And remember, we're fighting soon. We got a fight coming up in uh, September. Like, these are awesome and great, right? Because of... How much they value that? But this, I right, look at that Chewbacca. Look at those guys on the stick. On the stick. It's funny. Our uh, top pops is gonna be in New York City, and I was like, "Hey, what do you want to do? Want to share exclusives together?" And we're like, "All right, maybe we'll do something like that." I'm like, "Wait, maybe I just have them take the Long Island Railroad and have them come over." And see the crazy house. Toys of Galore. Make him do a little video. But we'll see. Hope you guys enjoyed everything. I'm out of here. Hang out.
See you next time.